Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another unboxing of an advent calendar on my channel and this will be a L'Occitane advent calendar that I will be unboxing today for you um, and I do have my little baby here and he will be as annoying as ever um, so let's just start with the unboxing uh, my face is the same as in previous unboxing video and it is because when I have the energy to actually do something about my face I want to take actually advantage of that and film a few videos so for that reason we are digging into another advent calendar here and I'm just gonna open it up and see what it looks like on the inside because I haven't done that yet Okay, so it seems like it is a little bit opened, but this is what the inside looks like, so yeah. Let's just dig into this. Mm -hmm -hmm. Let's find number one. And number one is right here. I have never tried anything from L'Occitane, maybe I should start with that. and. I don't know anything about this brand, so this will be very interesting to see what I get and if I like it eventually when I do try it. So this is the, oh my god, so many French brands, I am not good with French, but this is Precious Cream, 5 milliliters of Immortel something Precious Cream. Um, so this is Precious Facial Facial cream so I am guessing this is for your face 5 milliliter is a very cheap and I can always already tell you that in the light I see that this part here is not filled a bit of this is not filled there so there is a very little in this little sample size thingy in there this was actually quite expensive I think or was it I don't remember how much it costed. I purchased this a few months ago. But either way, I hope it's worth it. Now let's see if I can find number two. Oh, number two seems to be even smaller. Number two is... Ultra, ultra, ultra rich lip balm. 4 milliliters so this one is even smaller and in the light I can tell you that the lip balm comes up to about here in this small small sample so yeah 10% shea butter so maybe I should be happy about that I was so happy with the previous one it was Eve's Rocher if you want to see it go and see it I was really happy with that one so this is a bit disappointing I guess I don't know let's see number three hmm. number three looks like a big door that usually means nothing but here we go let's see well it is a little bit bigger item so this is the oh my god this is the smallest hand cream I've ever seen so this is ro rose hand cream 10 milliliters that's like five uses for me I mean this is literally the smallest hand cream I've ever seen which is kind of cute but also what number four now we're talking so this is ultra rich body cream 25% of shea butter this is 20 milliliters, so this is at least a deluxe size thing, but also looking at the lighting, this is not full. I am a little bit disappointed so far, but let's see, number five. I guess it's small items that you can try, and I should be happy about small items because easier to use up and I will have a bunch of them now so yeah another hand care thing um, with almond from Provence delicious hand hand care 10 milliliters so I'm guessing this is some sort of a hand cream again um, yeah another small hand cream number six is a very very small one 
Okay. So this is... What is this? Does it say anything? So it is a bath bomb with essential oils of mint, pine and rosemary. So a bath bomb that looks like a square. Smells very herbally, I would say. Yeah, very herbally. I'm not sure that's my scent. Um, number seven. I think this could be the worst advent calendar that I have opened this year. And I purchased one really cheap one for like $10, $20 or something like that. And I opened it. It was, I think, my first one that I opened. And I like that one more than what I think I like this one. So another hand cream. This is the Origin Lavender. So lavender hand cream. Another one for 10 milliliters hand cream. Uh, three hand creams so far. I would say that's a lot of hand cream. Is it number eight now? Maybe. Okay. This is something different. This is shower oil. Cleansing and softening shower oil with, I would say, almond probably. 35 milliliters. So this is the biggest item we have gotten so far. Um, the bottle looks nice. Um, number nine, uh, this is light comforting cream, is it for face, uh, facial cream, cream facial suave, so I'm guessing this is some kind of face cream, five milliliters, another mini size of that, and it's not full either okay number 10 come on number 10 number 10 is a bit bigger this is 20 milliliters this is with almond milk milk concentrate but what are you um, apply morning and evening on the whole body so this is body cream I would prefer if they actually wrote on the front like what is it for so that I don't have to find within all of this text in the background what am I looking at and no that wasn't fully either. Uh, number 11. Oh this looks like an interesting bottle that's a very very cute bottle at least so this is Verbena body lotion I think this is what that one looks like, but it is really, really cute with this pattern. I don't know if you're able to see in the camera, but it has this really nice pattern on the side. And I like that it is kind of square-ish. Um, I, re I recognize the Verbena thing. I might have had some kind of sample thingy of this previously. But yeah, I really like the packaging of this one. That made me kind of happy. Number 12 is down here another hand cream uh, this is cherry blossom hand cream another 10 milliliters hand cream uh, is that like four hand creams at this point four or five that's a lot of hand creams wouldn't you say and number 13 lucky number 13 where are you was that number 13? No, that was 12. Number 13 is a shampoo with five essential oils. So, some kind of shampoo, small size, 35 milliliters. That's the biggest items that we've gotten so far, 35 milliliters. In ounces, that is 1.1 fluid ounces, if you're wondering. Number 14. Oh, that's another small one. This is Alt Ultra Thirst Quenching Cream. Uh, 
aqua something, 5 milliliters, and I am guessing this is also for the face. Yes. So, another mini. Is it full? It doesn't look to be, nope. And number 15. Do we have number 15? We do have not. Come on, come on! Another hand cream with 20% of shea butter. So we have another hand cream. That's a lot of hand cream in this one. I'm not sure, do they not have other items than hand cream? Or am I just not? I don't know. Number 16. There we have a milk extra gentle soap. So it's a soap bar, a small soap bar for 25 grams. And number 17. Oh my god, it's another hand cream. Dear lord, I, my hands will be so moisturized. This one has 25% of shea butter. So we started at like 10, now we're 25%. Very dry skin, intensive hand balm. So another hand cream, I mean. Yes, okay. Number 18 is another soap. This is soap with verbena leaves and it is shaped like a leaf on the inside. Really pretty. Um, I do love hand soaps and soap bars, at least they last a really really long time, so I feel like they're worth the money, they are good for the environment, so for that reason I like them. So I'm not mad about that, I'm not mad about anything, I just think the samples are very small and there is a lot of hand cream in there. Um, what is this? This is the 5 essential oils conditioner so this is the conditioner that goes together with the shampoo i think that's really nice to put in a shampoo and a conditioner and in the same line so that you get a feel for the whole line you see if it's something for you number 20 i'm going to cry what is this <sighs> it's another it's a cooling hand cream gel, so it's another version of a hand cream. Um, but this one, I guess, is with verbena, whatever that is. Okay, um, 21. Oh, it's another one in this nice packaging, so this is the verbena shower gel. So this is what it looks like. So it's this nice packaging with the leaf on the side. I really like this packaging. Nice. Uh, 22 is a cherry blossom bath and shower gel, 35 milliliters. Not mad about that. We'll be enjoying it. Cherry blossom should smell awesome. See what I did there? Number <laughs> okay, so number 23. I almost thought it was another hand cream, but no, it's a foot cream for dry skin with 15% of shea butter. <coughs> well, at least it's a foot cream. Foot cream is always good to have. Nicely done. And number 24, our largest thing here. And the last item in this advent calendar is the Aqua Water Gel Cleanser, which I am assuming is for your face. <laughs> I... It just say don't eat it, but it doesn't say for what, but I'm... I'm guessing it's for your face and it is 40 milliliters, which is the biggest thing we have gotten in this calendar literally as I look at it it looks like a bunch of small I'm 
this is a few of them but this looks like a bunch of just small samples that you would get in a glossy box or any other subscription box or whatever this was by far the most disappointing advent calendar for me this year I have two more left to open one of them I did not open on camera the Nivea one that I had I didn't open on camera and I really enjoy that one the two that I have left to open with you if I don't decide to purchase any more than that are amazing I just know they are going to be fantastic so I I'm already excited um, but this was really anti-climatic I would say I do enjoy opening it and as I said uh, small samples mean that I will be getting through them faster which means I will not have them in my collection for a longer period but as from what I see right here none of this so far entices me to buy anything from this brand again but we'll see when I try them maybe the items are amazing and I will just love them and fall in love with them and want to purchase everything you never know but this was it for this video. If you liked it, make sure to like it down below as well. Make sure to subscribe if you already haven't. Me and my tiny little baby that's sleeping, we would love to have you here more often. And I really hope to see you in my next one. Bye!